Also this morning, emotions running high as parents and students in Baltimore City demand a solution to Baltimore's cold schools. Yeah, it's been a huge story we're covering. Parents and family members took over a city school board meeting last night to sound off about the ongoing problem. ABC 2 News' is Cassie Carlisle is live at Calverton Elementary Middle. Cassie, it's closed today because of the cold? Yeah, that's right. Calverton was closed yesterday as well. And now angry parents are urging the school board to do something about the cold schools. Now, it wasn't on the agenda last night, but it took up a majority of the meeting. Family outraged that year after year they have to fight for attention to get something done for their babies who can't fight for themselves. Within the last week, Governor Larry Hogan pledged $2.5 million to help. Mayor Pugh outlined a plan to close schools that are too cold and open rec centers to provide food. But before that, kids sat in 40-degree classrooms, bundled up in winter coats, fueling their parents' outrage. These same children fight their way through adversities that come with living in poverty, barely having their basic necessities at home, such as food, heat, and electricity. They are afraid to go outside because they are scared they may get hit by a stray bullet. Once they fight through all that, imagine having to fight through all of that just to come to school with no heat, where it's so cold that our children can barely hold a number two pencil in their hands. And the district called for a town hall meeting on this specific subject. That will be January 22nd at 6 p.m. at Dunbar High School. Christian and Ashley, 